come in under sail and anchor under sail and hopefully not hit anything. Fingers crossed that it all works out. No, really, man, we're going to miss your face around here. You've been a pleasure to have aboard. Oh, sad face. This is... <laughs> <laughs> We're kicking him off. Oh, they're kicking Time me off. Time to leave. And they get get off. off. Salama Puggy. Puggy Mama. How was your night? Do you know what I really enjoy while Jay's in the boat? You enjoy your sleep. <laughs> to sleep all the night through. Was it just like this all night? Oh, I fell asleep too. No one was on watch, were they? Oh. I know it was. The AOS was. It was your last night, Tassie. Oh, I'm still asleep. Oh, he's not camera ready. Sorry, folks. It's not usually what he looks like. Don't worry, I'm never camera ready. <laughs> Just like this. It's just like this, everybody. Just like this. Turn it down. What are you thinking, Lily? Where are we oh. next to? Um, we're in a safe zone. There's no rocks or nothing around us, are we? We're not there yet. We're near the danger zone. Not near that. Um, no idea. We're probably about an hour or so out of Padang, and um, we just noticed a slight change in the sound of the engine. Um, I've just lifted up the floor and there's just smoke coming out so I don't know yet I'll just let the smoke clear out and inspect a little further it's not looking good I don't know what's wrong but it, it's I had no sort of real rev movement either so smoke's not a good sign is it nah, I'll just have a look in a second and assess the situation yeah, I was like, oh crap, I was We're not too far strong. from town, we've got a light breeze, so we can probably just put the headsail up and slowly sail in, and we should be safe. I'm just going to start sailing this in in case you need to drop the pick. Yeah. the danger zone. Yeah. So give a wide so. berth to that danger zone. We've got a minefield ahead of us, but we can't drop the pick there, otherwise we could uh, go kaboom. Just changing my pants because I always get into trouble for wrecking my good pants because I'm always in the engine bay. And, um, Big one, honey. I really don't know. There was smoke going on down here, so obviously something's got really hot. It's been motoring for a while, but I can't see where they've got water running through properly and they've got enough coolant running. Water cooling going through. Lily spent the next 20 minutes troubleshooting the problem. Yeah, the belt runs your water pump though. Oh, really? Yeah, the exhaust is leaking. <laughs> so what it is? One piece, just one piece of pipe? A couple of hose clamps? No, it's the welds cracked. Mm. Where it joins the mixing helmet. Oh, the welds cracked. The world. Ouch. The but I don't world. understand why it's smoking and why that's all black like that though, that's all. Because all, cause that would have been the exhaust filling up the engine bay. Do you know that we have a little fishy in there? There's a little fishy in there. The world's, the world's about to end and Sweetie's just so pumped on the little fishy in your arm. Let me say strainer. <laughs> <laughs> little fish.
Can I get, can I rescue it? What are you going to call it? Has it got a name? It's Arnold. Arnold? Arnold. It's an interesting name for a fish. Is that the only problem, the exhaust? We don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Oh, well, I've got enough breeze to get us into port. Sails, sails. Sails gonna J us in. We are a sailboat. That's sails. the good thing about being a sailboat, I guess. Yeah. We can sail all the way home. Jay's all over it. It's gonna oh. sail us into port. No problem here. I'm just gonna sail it all the way to the beach, step off full Pirates of the Caribbean style with me board bag, and then leave you guys to fix your broken boat. Oh. What a mate. I might what bring, a mate. I might bring magnums. Okay. <laughs> Pretty much just a pipe. It's a very small world, and I, we'd definitely be able to find a welder in town. But I'm just concerned where I take the exhaust elbow off the manifold there. Like, I've just all the bolts are rusted. I just hope nothing goes crack. That's my concern. These are always concerns. But I don't think it's anything major. It's I don't understand how it smoked up like that though. That I don't understand. I can get the exhaust elbow off. It'll just be a simple three minute weld job. But as long as the four bolts that go under the housing don't snap. The that's a bush mechanic, eh? Yeah. I can weld. You can weld, Bell. So that's us. We'll sail in. Oh my gosh. So that there is a result of smoke, exhaust smoke and salt water, I'd say. And it's just clogged that. And then we've seen an a drop in the revs, so the engine obviously couldn't breathe. You can see how it started sucking really hard, and that was only replaced not long ago, so that was a pretty new filter. Love and Bajo. Yeah, Love and Bajo, that filter was replaced. So hopefully we can find a filter and a welder. There you go. Can. I reckon we're in a pretty good spot. Couldn't really happen at a bit of place though. Yeah. Like you're sailing into the you're sailing into the main town. That's a strike of luck for sure. Alright, so the motor's unfixable at this stage. Um, it needs to be welded. We've got no air filter, so we're purely under sail while I was below. Um, trying to get rid of all the smoke. I thought there may have been a fire because there was so much smoke below. Um, Jay had put the sails out and there was enough wind to sort of just get us along. So um, we're coming into a port now and it's getting to the end of the season with all the charter boats. So there's going to be charter boats everywhere and it's a harbour, there's ships and whatnot. So we've just got to be so careful because we're going to have to come in under sail and anchor under sail and hopefully not hit anything. Fingers crossed that it all works out. It's all like 10 metres, so there's no need to really go in too close, I don't think. What's going on, Lily? Oh, look, we're just coming into Anchorage. It's um, about 10 metres, so there's no need to really get up too close to the shoreline. I don't think there's any hazards here. Apart from us not having an engine, I'd say we're the hazard. But, uh, this head sail and I think we're about right and then we'll drop a pick and that's about all we can do. Looking pretty good. Put the fingers crossed and let the wind set the anchor. All over it. Who needs an engine? Don't say that yet. So just coming into port on sail. Under sail. We haven't done this before. We'll see how we go. It worked out there was plenty of room and we came in smooth sailing. 
dropped the anchor and thanked our lucky stars for getting us here safely. We have said it before, but I'll say it again. Teamwork makes the dream work. Nicely done, Team Catalpa. So it's, uh, Jay's about to get off the boat. He's had a nice few weeks with us aboard Catalpa. Did you? Was it nice? Amazing. It was really nice. Do you want me to talk to you or the camera? It doesn't matter. <laughs> really you can talk to me. Um, did you have a good time? I had an amazing time. I don't want to leave back? now. I don't want to leave. It's very sad. We're going to miss you. We'll miss you. Catalpa luxury got charters. <laughs> How was your bunk? How did you sleep? It was amazing. Lily knocked me up a pretty spectacular bunk. Um, I believe it was a modification that was made just before I arrived. I felt a little bit special that he did that. But it was amazing. Real comfy. I um, I brought a fan on board because I came from somewhere a bit colder and I thought I was going to get cooked and I nearly burned the boat down with the fan. But uh, we got through it. We had some good waves, good times. You never guess the places that I've been. You never guess the places that I've been. Cause everything is like a dream, yeah, but only in that dream that I live in. I'm never gonna let the day begin. Never gonna let the day begin. Cause everything is like a dream, yeah, but only in that dream that I live in. Back to work for a beer, work on some some exciting new projects and then get back over here to get to I don't really do too much actually, just, oh, yeah. just hang out with mates on their yachts and go surfing. This guy's a pretty good videographer and uh, if you need any videographing done, is that what it's called? Any small businesses out there need some commercial uh, video production done for online marketing or, or um, anything really, website, social. He's got a world Man. of experience. He may look young, but he's quite old. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, man, we're going to miss your face around here. You've been a pleasure to have aboard and um, come back real soon. Thanks, sweetie. Thanks for all the awesome meals. My pleasure. Oh, hey. He's choked up. He, he can't choked. talk. He's so sad you're leaving. Oh, I come here. <laughs> so big, so wet. <laughs> Oh, so disgusting. I'm really regretting that. I'm really, really regretting that. It's been, it's been engine problems. I'm just sort of coming good after Yeah. That, we haven't had the funnest afternoon. No, it hasn't been no, too bad. No, we've had a pretty good run. There's been no dramas until this afternoon coming in, and um, we handled that pretty well. So. You handled that beautifully. And we yeah. have had no dramas for ages. We've had a really good run. So it's all right. We kept. We had dramas just coming into a port, which was pretty good luck. The water levels on Kapow are a little bit low at the moment with all the hot showers, but uh, we can oh. fill that back up. <laughs> <laughs> what are you implying? Uh, they love it. You know what they like. But, uh, he keeps, they keep telling me I'm just a land lover that uses up all their water on board, but I don't know. No, we got, him, we got him down to 15 minute showers, so <laughs> <laughs> should be right. <laughs> Thanks so much, Team Catalpa, for having me on board. I've had an absolute ripper time. Um, super hospitable, boat's amazing, surf was great, and uh, yeah, stoked to be a part of it. <laughs> no, it's pretty, what you're doing with the videos is pretty special. Um, I haven't seen you guys for what, three and a half years? And um, yeah, to be able to just switch on the computer and, and uh, log in and, and see what you guys have been up to is pretty cool. And I'm just super proud of what you're doing with your, with your family and, and with the kiddies. And, and you can really see that they enjoy what you're doing and mate, they've grown up so much. And uh, yeah, it's, it's really a pretty cool thing what you're doing. So. Yeah, I'm stoked for you and can't wait to come back and play again. I also want to mention that this guy right here was our very first patron. He was the first guy to go, yeah, what you're doing is great. He was the biggest support and we just, back then, two years ago, so grateful for everything that you ever said to me 
to encourage men to do what I'm, I'm going to cry oh. to do. Oh. And uh, yeah, I just want to thank you for that because oh. do it, go for it. And because um, he's got a video background, it was like he was always there. I had asked him things and he's just been real helpful. And yeah, you were our first patron that meant, that meant so much to us. So to be a part of it. You know, oh, I'm, not, I'm not sweaty. Fucking smelly pirates. Oh, okay. oh sad face. Just, just get your toothbrush and just chuck it in your board bag, mate. <laughs> Here you go. Such a grubby surfer boy. Think we're good, bros. Just move that Jay was getting off the boat, but it wasn't goodbye just yet. He was staying in a hotel for a couple of days. We got to see that face again. Heading to Ababa, the boys are going to get shaved because they're a bit hairy. The hairy little face. Ah, oh, been at sea for a long time. Hello. So this hairy, hairy man is going to have a haircut. Oh, takes a lot off. I usually do it, but he's having a mandate with his man friend. Should I get a haircut? I think Jay will miss having the camera shoved in his face. What do you think? So I think my one should be a little bit easier. <laughs> Up to you, mate. Translating what he wanted was a bit of a challenge. decided his beard was getting a bit on the long side so joined the boys This luxury treatment cost all up 20 Australian dollars. Pretty reasonable to clean up these grotty yachties and they did a great job. What do you reckon, Jay boy? Sate I am super duper bloody bagus mate. Oh. Oh. He's 
Jason. That's cool. That's Getting a week later. The reef. That's One week later. Mate, I tell you what, that rock come up real fast and I'm lucky it was about four inches to that side. <laughs> oh. Would have gone straight up the freckle. <laughs> oh. It was last beers for these two mates for a while. Cheers, big ears, to future adventures. Oh, we got to say goodbye. Now my man is gone And I know I've been so wrong Now he's on his way And I know it was over anyway And I know it was over anyway These videos are made possible by our patrons. Thank you all so very much. We have many people out there that believe in us, but yeah, I just gotta give them a little mention. Right, go, go team, Sally. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. That's all you got? The camera's on. Cat, 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 quick, cat. Oh, that's all right. Thank you. 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 Thank is that real? Is that, I think you've is that real dark chocolate? I think you've overcooked that. <laughs> oh, baby. no, 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 come on. He's going to take it it's with him. It's a trademark. So remember, nothing will get dirty in your bag. Just pop it in there. Do oh, yeah. you enjoy having Uncle Jay aboard? Yeah. Yeah. I love that they're still camera shy. Up next, Lee gets back in the engine bay. Things don't go so smoothly in immigration, and we find a welder to fix our exhaust. Oh. What's happened? Well, I don't know. I gave it to the guys. I should have overlooked it, but... Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you like that video, please give us a thumbs up and share with your friends. And if you haven't already subscribed, click the subscribe button. Cheers, guys. See you next time. Bye. That's it. Welcome to all. Thanks to you all.